What's up everyone? Welcome back to another vlog. In today's vlog, we are decorating for the holidays. Something I actually didn't think I was going to be doing this year, but since my house keeps getting delayed and delayed and delayed, I think that in order for myself to feel any sort of Christmas cheer, I need to decorate. So that's what we're doing today. I'm enlisting the help of my sister Allie, which you guys haven't seen in a while because she refuses to make any YouTube videos. And my good old friend, Nicole, which you've been seeing a lot of. They're both here staring at me. My Christmas decorations are currently shoved at the back, back, back of a closet. So in order for us to decorate, we're gonna have to go on a little mission. But I also am missing some stuff. I wanna get garland, I wanna get a few other decorative objects. Normally, I'm starting to decorate like November 1st, but this year, I'm just not feeling it. I don't know why. Maybe it's because it hasn't snowed yet. Hopefully decorating will get me in the Christmas cheer. And we're going to make some Christmas cookies and just have like a joyous evening. But before that, I need to clean this house because I'm not going to decorate with a dirty house. And that actually brings me to one of my latest obsessions. And they're actually sponsoring today's video. And that is Roid Me, my new favorite vacuum brand. So they actually sent me their vacuum um, a few months ago and I've been using it ever since. Because I have a two floor condo and I have to be carting my vacuum around this entire condo, I know my life is so difficult. I wanted to get a vacuum that was very lightweight, easy to use, as easy as possible. You guys know I'm like the laziest person in the world. So I wanted a very easy, portable, lightweight vacuum. So if you guys haven't heard of Roid Me, they're actually a tier one vacuum brand in Asia and they're expanding in to North America and I have just been obsessed with it obviously a very sleek looking vacuum it's white and it's a little bit smaller than you know the other vacuums I've had and I love the white with the orange it's just very sleek they are a little bit of a higher-end vacuum brand but the quality is so worth it and I'll explain why I love it in just a sec but also it's just a very cute vacuum and you know, when something's cuter, I want to use it. One of my favorite things about this vacuum, which honestly, like, I didn't realize how useful and how much I needed this until I started using this vacuum. When you press down on the button, it just stays on. You don't have to continuously hold the button. And it's also a very quiet vacuum compared to the other ones that I've used before this. And it's extremely lightweight. It also has a 60 minute battery time and it has a 10 cyclone filtration system which separates the dust so your filter doesn't get blocked. Another thing I love about this is that it does have a magnetic wall mount so it's easy to just mount to your wall. I actually have it mounted upstairs. But you see this little thing on the back here? I don't know about you, but I used to like lean my vacuum against my wall and I would always like walk away and then hear it tumble to the ground and then I'd be like <sighs> But this one because of the rubber it stays up against the wall You don't have to worry about it falling over or scuffing your walls With the Z1 Air you get this vacuum head, but you can switch it up. They also give you this one so you can get all the little nooks and crannies and it's so lightweight like I wish you could feel how lightweight it is and this is narrow enough to get in between my little door tracks and just get all the dust out of all of the places so I've been loving that one but I'm gonna have to call in my sister for this one because this is her little her favorite thing like she loves this she's asking for it for Christmas so actually now I know what I'm getting you for Christmas <laughs> because she loves it she has not stopped using it ever since she picked it up you haven't seen her for a while. And yeah. you look a lot better than me right now. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> this has become my new baby, and I think today you fell in love with it too. I did. So this is a P1 Pro vacuum, and as you can see, it's a very small vacuum. So this is good for little messes, like after I cook dinner, if there's crumbs, if you cut a piece of toast, like you could just vacuum up the crumbs. Or if you wanna get on like the chairs, I always have crumbs that fall after I eat on my velvet chairs. So it's just a little handheld vacuum and it has this little magnetic topper here so you can close it. And Allie actually showed this to me, but if you press this, these little brush heads pop up. And I have used this every single day since I got it. All you have to do is charge it with the charger that they give you and you turn it on. And there's two modes. This is perfect for me because I make little messes everywhere I go. I leave like a trail of messes and then I can just go suck it all up. Also, I forgot to mention this vacuum also has two modes and it lasts for 60 minutes. This has a 24 minute battery time. If you're cleaning your car, 
which I actually have to do. It's perfect. Yeah, so that would be such a good thing to give to someone who, or like your dad, if your dad's really into cars. My dad? Well, <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm saying like to their dad. Uh -huh. Like if you have someone who's really hard to shop for, I mean, even for me, I have my handheld vacuum, but it is still such a rigmarole to go and take it off the wall mount mm -hmm. and get the attachment. This is just so easy to pick it up and go. Yeah, so this has been like a game changing, item for me honestly i didn't know something could be so useful but i literally carry this around the house everywhere with me also i was using it on her before yes. it gets like little particles off your clothes the light comes on here let me show you so you can see all the dust and you don't miss anything which i think is very smart mm. no i honestly really love that little vacuum it's all i'm going to be able to think about so if you wanted to pick one up uh they are having a black friday sale the p1 pro is on sale for 109 dollars and the z1 air is on sale for 279 so i will leave the link down below you will see me using them throughout the video but i just wanted to come on and thank them for sponsoring today's video and for just creating amazing vacuums and yeah. and, and for figuring out what I'm gonna buy my sister for Christmas. Well, also because this is something that you might not say to yourself, oh, I need to buy this for myself, but it, like, I would be so excited to receive it. Now we're gonna head out to Winners. Allie's gonna stay back, she has to do some work, but Nikki and I are gonna go shopping, and then I'll show you guys what we picked up, and we're gonna decorate when we get back. Can't wait to see. <laughs> We are on our way to Winners and Walmart, of course. I also need to get coffee creamer and I wanted to check for the new peppermint silk coffee creamer. Peppermint mocha. Peppermint mocha silk coffee creamer. Silk coffee creamer, because silk coffee creamer is the best coffee creamer. So we're going to Winners Home Sense to see if they, why is it so foggy in here? Foggy. What are we looking for? I want to kind of look for a wreath, wreath, wreath. Wreath with a wreath. TH. A wreath? Not with an F, wreath. <laughs> so it's not a reef. It's not a reef like a coral reef. <laughs> um, I want to look for that and maybe garland, maybe some like reindeer, some snowmen, some gingerbread men, a nutcracker. Tony, you used to be obsessed with snowmen growing up. Like she had a crazy obsession. I don't know why I did that. Like you were obsessed, you and your mom. I know, my mom's like still obsessed with snowmen. I don't know if they're gonna have much because it was just a weekend, you know? And I feel like the stock has been cleared. Yeah, I'm pretty sure the stock comes in on Mondays at Winners. I think it comes in on Tuesdays, but we are here. Well, we're decorating today, so we're gonna make it work. We're here. I wish there was cute little stores that we can go to, but there's none around me. Oh, that's too far. Yeah, it's a little far. I'm not sure if I wanna like use my old Christmas tree. Or just get like a new Christmas This one looks like it's missing a few well, that's branches. Well, that's because you gotta flock it. Like, oh, sorry, I'm Jewish. It's a little wobbly. <gasps> that's perfect that's for you. That's so cute. <laughs> Joy, Mary, Kind of, oh, do you like those? Mm -hmm. Do you like that one? Yeah, I love the white. But I kind of like this one more. I feel like it's less fluffed. Ooh. Yeah. Do you like it? I wish they had this in Leo's size. So we found the truffle jackpot. Black truffle tomato pasta sauce. Black truffle porcini sauce. Black truffle custard. But then they have these sets. Black truffle balsamic vinegar oil sauce. We're gonna get both. And you know what? They make good gifts. I like that it has like a, a wrap. For our baking. There's a green one! Like these or do they look kind of moldy? But there are they cute? Yeah. The thing about these is I don't like that you have to figure out how to hang on. You I don't normally just throw them in the tree. I just don't like their bow ties. This is perfect for 
for me. Are you pulling a joke on me? I'm pulling a joke on you. This one has green in it. But it's not a nice, it's like a peridot. What's wrong with peridot? I it's like peridot, it's just not, it's just not a Christmas green. Is this Barefoot Dreams? No. It's cupcakes and cashmere. <laughs> okay, so we got some good stuff at Winners that I'm really excited about. But now we're gonna stop at Michael's to see if they have garland, even though Michael is actually an extortionist with his prices, but so they normally have a coupon. These are my favorite ever. They smell so good. Mm. Look at this pretty garland, but it's expensive. $15. 21. You're lying. I think you even have to paint it yourself. <laughs> $40. Michael, we have to have a chat. That's how much it is. $80. <laughs> well, Michael's was a bust because they had absolutely nothing. And what they did have was a billion dollars so now we're going to walmart and then i think we might go to canadian tire well no we're definitely going to canadian tire i don't even know where people go christmas decoration shopping here like we don't have target we don't have all the fun stores so i think you have to order it online we don't have that kind of time we don't have that kind of time <laughs> maybe amazon okay so i wanted a green theme for my wrapping and obviously i came to walmart and look at this Okay, they have, oh, they have this beautiful, look at it, it's beautiful, it's stunning. And then green, the perfect shade of green, green boat. Alicia, you're not stealing my, my theme this year. But they also have a pink theme, a blue theme. Ooh, this is also nice, maybe I'll get this one too. This is also really nice. I'm not gonna buy this because Ali actually just bought this for me, but this is the best. This is the perfect gift for someone because you get this little Epsom salt, the bath, foaming bath body wash, and then a little spray. Apparently this is amazing. Ooh, that's also a good little set. Yeah. Removes 10 years of yellow stains and you get a pen. An overnight pen. I kind of want to try this. Try it. Okay, so we just got back from Christmas shopping. We all changed into our Christmas pajamas and I'm gonna show you what I picked up and then we're gonna start decorating. So we started at Winners. There was a few things, honestly, I think because it was just a weekend and people were like really getting in the Christmas spirit. I think it had just been ransacked because there was almost nothing left. But I did find this wreath. I just absolutely love. I'm still trying to figure out if I wanna put this outside or if I could even put it outside. Like, I don't know if it, wreaths can go outside really. Do you think they can? Stop calling it a wreath. What is it? A wreath. This isn't Christmassy, but they have a lot of truffle stuff. So I got this little truffle set. We're gonna make it for dinner. That one has truffle gnocchi, but this one is just truffle pasta. And there's truffle pesto. And my favorite thing in the world is truffle. So I had to get both. Those also make a really good gift. My sister just had a really good idea. If you wanted to give this as a gift, you can also get them like a serving dish and create like a whole little experience for them. And then I picked up these ornaments. I didn't pick this up this time, but I got this the last time I was at Winners and I saved it to show you guys. It's the cutest little candle that says, Merry everything, Merry everything and happy all. I didn't really look at what, <laughs> I didn't really look at what it said before I got it. I just saw white and red, but it's in my favorite winter scent. That just reminds me of my childhood. It's like smells like winter from Bath and Body Works. I got this green pan, which came with a cute little Christmas spatula and some cookie cutters. I'm a sucker for green this year. Do I really need a green pan for the holidays? No, but I am a sucker for green and it looks like there's like snow on it and it's, it's just a cute pan. And we're gonna bake cookies later, so we'll use that. And then they also had the Le Creuset Pen. Every time I go, I look for their stuff because they always have them at Winners and it's such a good deal. And then I got this for my living room. It is just a little blanket that has reindeers on it just to spruce it up and bring some holiday cheer. And of course, it's in my you know color tone. It has brown and beige, like I could not pass this up. Not a big fan of this peach right here, but. Then we went to Walmart and Walmart, of course, they had amazing things. They had amazing things, but again, 
we're just late to the party. We were, we should have gone over the weekend, but they did have this amazing set. So every year I have a theme for my wrapping. Last year it was Leo's face. I got his face printed on wrapping paper and this year I really wanted to go with green because I'm just obsessed with green. And of course Walmart has the perfect green set. A cream and gold, like how expensive? Do you know how much this set was? It was $16 for all of this. And then you get beautiful two green wrapping papers, you get bags, you get two accessory boxes, metallic bows of different sizes, 10 gift tags, curling ribbon, peel and stick labels, two shirt boxes, all for $16. And it's all cohesive, so no matter what you wrap or how you wrap it, it's all gonna look good together. They had a bunch of different colors. They had a pink one, they had a blue one, but I thought this one also went with the vibe, and you know, I like doing different vibes for different people. So, and this actually also goes with the green because the colors all kind of go together. But this is what this one looked like. So you have Christmas trees and white and gold and it has all the same stuff. It has gift bags. And then I also found these at Walmart. I'm gonna put them in my bathroom. Very cute little rags. Then they had a ton of gift boxes at Walmart you guys saw. So if you're looking for a gift, go to Walmart. They have a lot of them. I did buy one for myself though, I couldn't resist. The Colgate Optic White, visibly whiter teeth in one week. Removes 10 years of yellow stains. I really wanted to try this little pen thing, so I'm gonna try that tonight, it was $29. And then these are the cookies we're gonna make today. Gingerbread cutout cookies. I'm intrigued to see what they look like. I've never seen these before, have you? No. <gasps> oh, oh my God. And also, candy cane sugar cookie dough. So then we went to Canadian Tire, and Canadian Tire always comes through. I think a lot of my like decorations I got, I think I went on big buying spree two years ago for decorations. I think most of them are from Canadian Tire. They had this, this garland, which I want to put like hanging off of here. It's very glittery, so thank God I have my vacuum. And then they also had this nine feet long garland, which just, I have garland, but it was really, really cheap garland. It did the job, but then it got all mashed up. So I wanted to get garland and you can have garland for a long time. So this was, I think 40 bucks, but it's really beautiful. I picked up some Windex and I picked up some twist ties to tie the garland to my railing. So now we have to fish out all of my decorations from the back of this storage closet. Last year I first attempted to put the tree here, but then I ended up moving it here. So I think we're gonna just put it there where the olive tree was. I'm not sure where the olive tree is gonna go for now, but I think that's the best bet. So we got the tree out of my, yeah, it's just a big mess in here right now, but we're gonna open it up. It's a pretty easy tree to, to put together. Okay, so look how cute it looks. It makes me feel more Christmassy already. So that was really easy. My tree I got uh, two years ago from okay. the bay and I love it. Why did we think putting a tree up was such an ordeal? Because mom made everything an ordeal. <laughs> Look how beautiful. And then I think on this thing here, we're gonna, I'm gonna switch out maybe this one. I think I'm gonna put, oh, that's cute. Was it, maybe you should put that on the top. I don't think. Oh, gonna, it's not gonna fit. But you can put it at the top. Come to this year round. We have this reindeer at the top and then our garland. Honestly, it looks very cute in person. On camera, it's looking a little sad. Wonky. A little wonky and grinchy. Okay, I'm thinking that we're gonna have to swap out the orchid. I think well, the more you play around with it, the more like... Yeah. Orchid is not festive. You'll finesse it to more like what you want. Orchid is not festive. Oh, that's cute. I like that tones. As I said, I always start with like bigger items and I kind of like 
separate them. Does that clip on? Yes. That's so cool. I, these are from Walmart. I separate them so that they're like evenly dispersed and I cover the big holes in the tree, you know? So Tony, what's your favorite Christmas movie? Um, Elf. What's yours, Mickey? I do love Elf, but I think my favorite as a little kid actually used to be called Jingle All the Way. Isn't that so cute? ASMR. Ew, that literally looks like a wet log. <gasps> oh my god! <laughs> Tony! Back in the olden days when we were kids, this is how those, um, like the- Chocolate chip cookies. The chocolate, they still have it in the log, but the um, ones with like the trees and the you snowman, you have to cut them. just realized that some of them have skirts and some of them don't. Okay, let's try it. I'm gonna taste a girly. I think it's raw. But they're also burnt. But they're also raw. Okay, so these smell a little funky. It literally smells like Parmesan. Ew. <laughs> they're not great. So we just took a little cookie break. We're almost done this area. The tree's looking good. Now we're gonna do the garland, which I'm super excited about. This looks like the perfect, oh, the perfect garland. Do you have the zip ties? So I just have to see which side the plug goes on. Is it a plug? Oh my God, I think it's batteries. Nikki, I think it's battery operated. <laughs> we don't have batteries. <laughs> oh gosh. Oh, oh, I thought they gave you the battery. Okay, BRB. So this garland is battery operated, which I didn't know, but like, so that's so cool. That makes so much sense. And it is so pretty. The color is perfect. So now I'm just fluffing it. This is Leo's corner. Yeah, we're decorating Leo's area now, Leo's room. Oh my god, this is such cute garland. Okay, so I don't want to my own horn or anything, but this is the prettiest garland ever. The only thing is that I have to like hide some of the twist ties. You can kind of see them. But isn't it so pretty? And I love that it's battery operated because it just saves you like the headache of having to get an extension cord. And then extension cords are ugly. Let's be real. Hi, welcome to my home with my extremely high <laughs> your boxes and all my boxes oh i'm how this is what i get for getting this put a zip tie hi leo hi okay so it's been a few days the decorating is finally done i actually enlisted the help of my mom a little bit to kind of pull everything together i don't know why there's just nothing like a mom's touch when it comes to decorating she always just knows exactly what to do to make everything look like perfect she was actually here at my house watching leonard while i was in toronto over the weekend and she did some things and it just looked so good so i thought i would show you guys the final decorations and everything so you saw the reindeer we also have a reindeer blanket on this chair here, as you guys know, I was a little iffy about this 
garland but my mom added these cranberries i don't even know where she found these cranberries and i think it just ties the whole thing together she was like i'm sorry i just had to add it i was like no i love it this is exactly what it needed it also tied in the red so these stockings i actually got on um etsy they were custom made this one actually has a d on the back but we're just gonna forget that that is there <laughs> because it just looks weird without one stocking so we're just going to pretend that that is a plain stocking. And this one has a T on it for me. And then this is the tree. It's off right now, but I, I just love this tree. I've done the same tree for three years. I don't know how people continuously buy new ornaments and new themes because it's so expensive. So I'm sticking with this theme until further notice. Over here, not much. I have my little coasters. I had these since I was a kid. This candle, which I marry everything and happy always. I don't know. I don't know you guys over here i have some this is like my junk table but i have my little tree and a little i have to hang that up it's so cute it's like this is also from my childhood me and then over here there's not much else that's going on honestly or i have a lot of stuff i have no room for so it's all kind of in the corner and then this is the garland and i just love this garland so much i love that it's battery operated my mom put a snowman kit <laughs> so that is my christmas decorations for this year i'm really happy that i actually did end up decorating for the holidays which i wasn't going to do because of the whole fiasco with my house i was like a little little bit of a grinch i was being a little bit of a grinch this year but I'm so happy I did. Yes, you helped me decorate, Leo. Thank you. Have you guys decorated? I know a lot of you guys are waiting for um, after Thanksgiving in the US, but our Thanksgiving was in October. Also, don't forget to check out Roy and Me for their Black Friday sale. Thank you once again for sponsoring this video. My mom actually, when she was staying over, she tidied my house because she just can't help it. She messaged me saying, I love your new vacuum because it's so lightweight and she has arthritis in her hands and it was really easy for her to use. So that's amazing. So. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe for new videos every single week. I love you guys and I'll see you guys back here next time.